Minute, 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 minute. Library minute. Hey kids, Mr. DeBrew here with your library minute. Today we're going to learn how to find that next book in the series you've been reading. Let's go! A lot of times kids will be reading a book and it's part of a series and they'll ask me, well, what's the next book in, in the series? So here's what you do. From the library webpage, you go to reading links on the left side. Reading links. And there's one called Juvenile Series and Sequels. Click on that. And then you can search by series title, series subject, book title, or book author. Let's say you know the title because you're reading the book and it's sitting there in front of you. As an example, let's say you're reading Scorch Trials. And you want to know what the next book is. Scorch Trials, the... I'll click on there. Okay, now it tells you it's part of the Maze Runner series, and it is book number two. So I'm going to click Maze Runner, and scroll down a little bit, and this shows the whole series now. So the next book is number three, The Death Cure. So now what I'm going to do, now that I have the title, is I'm going to go to KCLS dot org slash students and then I'm gonna to go to middle high school and college students scroll down to ebooks and audiobooks click search and death cure there we go all right we have three results. This one is the ebook, and there's a wait list, so you can put a hold on it. This is an audio book in the center that's available now, so you can just go ahead and borrow it. And this one is a different book entirely. So let's say we wanted to put a hold on it. First of all, I would click on it to see how many copies there are. There are 35 copies available, and it says it's available soon. So I'm going to go ahead and place a hold. And this is where it's going to ask you for your library card and PIN. And again, it's the number 411 plus your seven-digit student ID number. Or you can use your KCLS library card if you have one. The PIN is the last four digits of your student ID number. Okay? Easy as that. All right. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. This has been your Library Minute. I'm out. Library Minute.